welcome to the birthday vlog. Woohoo! <laughs> Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. I am very excited for this one because I just like to document the milestones of my life and tomorrow I'm going to be another year older, <laughs> which I'm honestly not looking forward to. I know I'm still young, but I think I'm finally getting to that point where I kind of dread my birthday. I think this is the first year that has really felt like I'm like not a kid anymore because I feel like my birthday just doesn't have as much significance as it once did, which is fine. But I have to say, I just feel like I'm getting older. I'm not a kid anymore and I'm an adult. Clearly, I literally live in my own apartment and pay my own bills, but whatever. I still feel like I'm a teenager sometimes and so we're just gonna spend my birthday truly like how I did as a teenager and I feel like that's kind of just like what I had to do is juxtapose exactly how I feel and throw like a childish birthday party. So tomorrow I've decided to like spend it with my closest friends having a pizza party. We're going to make our own pizzas and then a slumber party. I bought like four air mattresses and we're all gonna camp out in my living room and we're gonna eat junk food and watch movies and dance and have a great time. I literally am so excited. It's also pajama themed. So everyone's gonna be showing up in their pajamas to dinner and I can't wait. Let me move this camera because the lighting's getting funky. But I'm going to start the vlog here and kind of just document the festivities of today, prepping for my birthday, tomorrow, the celebration, and then just kind of treating myself this weekend. I feel like it's another year to reinvent myself. So today I'm getting a blowout. I'm getting my nails done. Uh, all the things that make me happy. Oh, a little quick outfit check before I headed to my appointments for the day. I'm giving you like chic girl because, I don't know, I feel like I get dressed based on like my mood. And today I'm like, I'm running errands. And so I want to just like look like a chic New York girl on the go, but I feel like this isn't something I would normally wear. So maybe I'm like dressing into a character. So we're wearing our classic Levi's 501 90s, I believe they are. And I paired it with this belt from below the belt, the long sleeve, best long sleeve in the world. If you know, you know, into Missy Me. And the trench coat is from Golden Goose. And then I tied it all together with these gold loafers from J. Crew. Super cute. And the Hello Kitty headband, of course. bubble bath and I organized some of the decorations for tomorrow um, I'll show you there's gonna be like a little popcorn station candy bar situation and this skincare company Elizabeth Arden was kind enough to send everyone like some skincare essentials for the night since it's a slumber party okay I swear to god pocket only cries when I vlog like this is not a normal occurrence but <laughs> second I pick up this camera he's like you're not paying attention to me but I was just DJing for like 30 minutes and he was sleeping in his bed and no crying I have our little Hello Kitty plates every year is Hello Kitty themed for my birthday nothing new and then some chips in case anyone gets hungry throughout the night as well as a little soda station tell me I'm like where's the tequila nope just coca-cola and spray over here um, it's a very wholesome birthday, but I'm very excited for tomorrow. I'm gonna get a good night's sleep and wake up early and take Pocket on a walk to start my day. Nighty night. Oh, this boy woke me up very early to celebrate, I'll have you know. And he's got a lot of energy right now, so we're gonna start off our day with a walk. 
everywhere so probably won't be included that um clip due to his privacy we are home now it's 8 30 and i just threw on a little outfit for the day very comfy i'm going to aloe we're starting the day off right with a workout and i'm doing it with my two friends cashmere and devin i'm sure you guys know and yeah we're gonna do a little workout with sarah a little training and then devin and i after that are gonna head to tribeca to this place called Air, A-I-R-E, like Kylie Jenner's baby. <laughs> and we're getting massages and they have like different baths and stuff. So we're just gonna have like a little relaxing afternoon situation. My workout outfit is aloe underneath Supreme pants, the ones I bought the other day. Um, this gray little sweater is from Koss. My puffer is from Stussy, and then my workout shoes are A6. And I'm gonna pack a little bag to bring with me to the spa that has like a swimsuit, fresh underwear, sweatshirt, t-shirt, sort of thing. Grand Central with SOS service. <laughs> yeah, guys, my phone went full SOS service because AT&T is lost. deciding to have an outage on my birthday. Did they not know? <laughs> birthday! I'm so late to the workout, but nonetheless, so we're gonna do some squats. Ten squats in the Thank you guys. I'm over your belly. Thank you for sweets. Oh, definitely. Always ready for sweets. I'm sweet. I woke up and he was like, "Look at me." Oh. Stop. He's so cute. That's so. You have to wear that. I need to work out with him. You have to wear that. It's like. It's like oh.
special year. Yeah! <laughs> Woo! I'm sad. <laughs> Made it. Slim. Got my crown on. <laughs> hey, we're home from the spa. Obviously, I couldn't record in there, but it was delightful. I actually really recommend it. I've been to Bathhouse in Williamsburg, and I much prefer air i think it is pricier than bathhouse but i think it was worth it just because the massage was a thousand times better and then it was just a lot cleaner and there was more baths to choose from and it was very nice i needed a relaxing morning because my morning was honestly a bit hectic i was running late to the workout and there was like a data i don't know what happened but my phone went in on sos mode for like two hours and i didn't have any cell phone service and i couldn't send any texts and yeah, first world problems. So I just came home to a flower delivery. So let's open it. <laughs> There's a French bulldog on it, which makes me think it's my mom, but I'm not sure. Wait, I think this is from Amanda. Oh my God, so cute. Stop it right now. It even printed out a picture of us. I'm gonna cry. And then she has a little note. So Amanda, Amanda's my best friend from my hometown. So these are stunning. Let's get them in some water. Wow. You like them, Pocket? How pretty. I'm gonna cry. Okay, I just got back from walking Pocket. I still haven't showered from getting my massage, hence why my hair is looking fucked up. Um, probably wasn't my best idea to get a blowout yesterday, but whatever. I just ordered my favorite lunch in the world. I love sandwiches and Compton's, it's in Greenpoint, is absolutely insane. They put sea salt and vinegar chips in the sandwich. Okay, it's, I think it's called like the Howl. I could be wrong though. It's turkey, it's American cheese, but I swap it with provolone. Sea salt and vinegar chips, tomato, mayo, banana peppers. I added the banana peppers, lettuce, it's fucking insane. So, I'm gonna eat this and then shower off and head, or shower off and then start getting my decorations put up for my birthday. And I think my friend Carly is gonna come over to help. Cheers. Carly just came over to help me decorate and she brought me my favorite thing. Okay, decorating is starting. So hopefully this is going to be a very satisfying time lapse of me and Carly decorating. <laughs> we are decorating. Fuck gets in his pajamas and he's ready for the slumber party and we're gonna give you a quick tour of what I've turned my apartment into. Before we do a quick fit check, this is literally what I'm wearing to my birthday. My ballet flats are from Ghani. Sweat outfit is supreme and then Pockets onesie is from Little Beast. Over here we have for our guests our little pajama rack to change into. So the robes are courtesy of Victoria's Secret. They're literally the softest things ever and we have some really cute options. The striped or the cheetah print. As well as some gorgeous silk pajamas in all different colors. These are from Intimacy Me. Softest pajamas in the world. You already know and obviously to go with the robes we have these gorgeous slippers for my guests to change into because this is a no-shoe household. Over here, we have our candy slash dessert bar and snack area, popcorn, how cute are these Hello Kitty little popcorn things. The sign and the star of the show. The slumber party area, so we have three beds right now. Coffee even has his own little bed. 
is all the pajamas without full skin keratin. <laughs> Serums from Elizabeth Arden. Some lip balms and moisturizers. And then Sol de Janeiro body mist because my guests will be smelling delicious if we're all gonna be sleeping in the same room. This stuff is my favorite body mist, like post shower. And then we have my favorite face mask in the world, which are these Do Dr. Jar Cairo rubber face masks. They're delicious. Some Ilia highlighter to take home for my guests. This is really amazing makeup, natural. Highly recommend. And the slumber area. <laughs> See you at dinner. Okay, so we've made it to Finny. We're about to get ready to do our pizza making class. Happy birthday to you! Oh, I hate that. What glass of wine are you on? First, I need my second. And 
look at this masterpiece. But I also think it requires a lot. Well, obviously it is sliced up now, but... Guppy cakes. You're so mommy coated. I think it's time he goes in his toe. It's good. So good. I love you, try it. Try it. You need to try it. Put it on your tongue. Yeah. It doesn't hurt. <laughs> Welcome. Oh, shut up. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. You did such a good job. No, it's literally so good. Oh my god! But how'd you get a full DJ's in here? Oh my god! What the hell? Oh my god! 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 Lucy got the job. D O N E. Wow. Oh my god. The cheetah print. Lucy. Lucy. Actually, shut the fuck up with this cheetah print. Cause like. This is so the Crispy? Crispy. Play it cool. <laughs> Good morning. It is Friday. We had a great big slumber party and I believe I probably stopped filming somewhere around midnight or 1 a.m. But we finished the night by watching Cheetah Girls and all sleeping in my living room and it was really wholesome and I have like the most thoughtful caring friends in the world and the entire night just felt so surrounded by love and I feel like it was truly my best birthday yet and they got me really caring like thoughtful gifts they all know me very well and I thought I'd give you guys like a little haul of some cute things that I got. First things first, it was Hello Kitty themed. Everyone knows I love Hello Kitty by now. So that was a theme amongst my gifts. I haven't read this completely yet, but my friend gave me this book and it's like, you're my BFF and it has reasons and like memory things all across the book, like about prompts. It says, you're super cute when you walk around with pocket. <laughs> Next up, for my friend Sai, he custom made me like a bunch of fragrances, which is so sweet, and they're all in travel size, which is super nice, because I feel like I do have a lot of fragrances, but not travel size ones. A closet sale, a few months ago, she's based in New York, I believe she's from Australia, maybe New Zealand, but I feel like Australia, um, and she has a brand called Sierra Archive, wait, it, make sure I'm saying that right S-I-R-R-A-H archive um, anyways I love these bags that she sold at the store when I was doing my closet sale and she made me one which is so 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 special I think it's the most beautiful bag ever like the detail on this she finds all of these vintage charms and lockets and puts them on and the most special thing she did which I literally can't get over it's my new favorite bag like literally fuck a designer bag like this is so cute um so the locket here actually opens and it says i love you on it if you can't see the detail um so it opens and she added a fucking picture of my dog pocket like are you kidding me gorgeous gorgeous candles 
and they go in these little strawberry candle holders which i thought were just so cute for my home and then i can't show this on camera but he got me like a little smoke kit with a little j and it says hot girl shit on the ashtray okay, so we have a hello kitty lego kit and then a miffy keychain two of them absolutely adorable and then my friend got me vintage stickers which i thought were so cute i really want to start scrapbooking so i think i'm gonna start saving a lot of this stuff i got more stickers too hello kitty obviously but they're like really nice texture like the puffy stickers Oops. sorry pocket is playing so loudly in the background right now with his toy and then i got a vanity vacuum it like vacuums up powders and stuff which is so cool i probably need to clean out my vacuum i mean my vanity so happy to get that uh hello kitty mug can never have too many of these and it matches my pink coffee maker so super cute and then a miffy piggy bank how cute obsessed um and oh my god not even done yet my friends are literally the best this was super sweet my friend okay first off my friend got me this really cool book with my coffee table it's like scandalous pictures of legs from like the 60s and then my friend got me these two books to read which i'm going on a trip next week and i'm over my fucking book a little life i think it's just it's a slow one and i'm not a great reader so i think it's a little bit ambitious for me to just jump into that to start reading again so I'm going to read one of these books my friend recommended, especially because she made it so sp sentimental and special to me. The first one has annotations in the front, and it says, it's a quote from the book. Perhaps we become aware of our age only at exceptional moments, and most of the time we are ageless. Happy birthday, my dearest Lucy. May, you, may your heart... For, wait, sorry. I literally can't read cursive. <laughs> may you forever be young at heart. Love Sunita. So sweet. And this one as well. She said, Lucy, this book contains something about what it means to be a woman. I'm lucky to be able to witness you become into a beautiful one. Love Sunita. Literally, just so thoughtful and so, 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 so sweet. So, I have the best friends ever and I have the best day ever. And I love birthdays. Hi guys. Happy Saturday. I still have my bed laid out for sleepover because Pocket and I have been having a very cozy weekend. Oh my god, look at him. Okay, just got ready for the day. Cassie and I are gonna go grab lunch before my tooth gym appointment. Wearing my favorite eye mask in the world, Peter, Peter Thomas Roth. And I'm gonna do a fit check. It's so cold in New York, but of course, I just was really had my heart set on wearing this little dress from Bella Venice. Um, I layered it with a cashmere gray sweater underneath from J. Crew. This leather jacket is really soft and it's actually vegan. It's from a Paris. And my tights are tights, I don't know where the hell they're from. <laughs> my boots are from you. And the glasses that I can't seem to stop wearing the entire fucking week are from Lexola because they are basically the only sunglasses that I wear. This cheese bowl. Oh my god. Gorgeous. Yeah. Whoa, this eyeliner. Happy Sunday from Pocket and I. I had a very chill last night. Um, I ate pasta, watched Hannah Montana, and face masked it up. And I'm so happy I did so because I had a gorgeous night's sleep. I'm up early this morning and I thought it would be fun. That is Mom's Miffy. We do not chew on Mom's Miffy. So rude. I have enough time to take myself on a little breakfast date and walk with Pocket this morning before I have a little creative shoot with some girls at 12 o'clock and I just got all cute for the morning and so I thought I would show you guys a little OOTD rundown as well as a what's in my bag because I don't think I've ever filmed one of these and I was like we should do that 
I've been carrying this bag a lot. I find it to be very nice and transitional between day and night because it can hold so much, but it's still very compact. And I decided to really play into the denim styling today. So I have a full denim fit going on. The dress and the jeans and the belt are all thrifted. I have these gold loafers to tie in with the gold hardware and then just a black long sleeve underneath because it's still chilly in New York despite how sunny it is. Speaking of sun, same sunnies on my head this whole weekend. Lexola, new style, love them. So let's get in to the what's in my bag. This bag is obviously from Coach. It's a quilted denim tabby bag. And let's just get into it. It has a lot of different compartments. So we'll start in the back. FYI, this is a very raw what's in my bag because, oh, now you're chewing on my PJs. Now you're chewing on my PJs. Apologies for the brief interruption. I had to change the battery on my camera. Let's just get into what's in this damn bag. So starting in the back, we have this amazing little emergency pocket, as I like to call it. This very much has stuff shoved in here, and it's going to be a very raw what's in my bag. I haven't really cleaned it out recently. So starting off, we have this case that came in case my tooth gem falls out. Tooth gem case, number one item. I have a lip balm. This one is from Elizabeth Arden, and it's called the 8-Hour Cream. It has sunscreen in it. And I just really like it, so let's actually put this on. And the last thing I keep in this back pocket is an emergency snack. These are really cute. I got them for my birthday from a friend, but they're animal crackers in the shape of Sanrio characters. Then we open it up in the front. This part just flops up. And we have another little secret compartment, a slim one. And in here, I keep my Alex Earl lights, which I bought off TikTok shop. And then we have this first big pocket right here. And then it has like a little slim zipper pocket and another big pocket. So let's unpack these first because it's literally falling out. <laughs> my wired headphones, these are just trusty. I always keep them on me because my AirPod Maxes die a lot. And it sucks to be caught on the subway or caught on a walk in New York without your music. I also have my favorite lip combo in here, which I'm not gonna do because I'm a natural bare face today. It's the Refi lip combo, and I just feel like this stays on my lips better than anything throughout the night, and the shade just looks good with any makeup look. It's Fawn, and it's the lip liner and the lip gloss. And I actually only use like this lip liner part. I know you can like twist this off and do like a little mattifying, like seal it in, but that shit dries out my lips. So I just like the little pencil and then I put the lip gloss in the center. We also have my wallet, which honestly I kind of need a new one, but yeah, it's my moolah. In this center pocket, we have, <laughs> I'm such a dog mom. We have an emergency poop bag in case Pocket has an accident. This gorgeous, like compact mirror. I just love this. It's so cute and unique and it's literally art and so much more fun than like a little foldable mirror. So this is also from Refi. I also have an emergency hair clip in here in case I just want to pull my hair back. Um, this is also from Refi, a receipt, this was from my lunch yesterday with my friend Cassie, we went to Sunday in Brooklyn, I think I filmed that, but it was a really delicious French onion soup. So I went shopping yesterday and we went to Byredo and I got this color stick in Ole Terra, but <laughs> this is a hard shade name to pronounce. I am excited about this. It's like a multi-use stick and it's like a gold shimmery with like a blue flex shimmer like it gets caught in certain lights and I just thought this looked so pretty because you can put it on your eyelids, highlighter, and lipstick. Last but not least, the last thing in here is just random because my friend gave this to me for my birthday the other day and it's a little book and it has fill in the blanks for like all these different things if our lives were a movie, it would be Thelma and Louise. 
I know I can count on, always count on you because you're always there for everyone you love. And it just has really cute little notes and I haven't gotten around to reading the entire thing yet. So I threw this in my bag so I could read it in the car and on the subway and on my walks and stuff like that. So that's everything that's in my quilted denim coach tabby bag. I hope you enjoyed and I'll have the link in the description if you guys want to shop this style. But yeah, let's go get some breakfast. Okay, so I'm actually going to walk over to my sister's right now because she just told me that she got a bunch of fresh ingredients from the farmer's market this morning and is making breakfast sandwiches. So, free breakfast on her. Um, I'm trying to walk with Pocket. It's like a two block walk and I thought I'd show you how much she hates the cold. Come on. Yes, chef. Gorgeous. Wow. able to show too much from the photo shoot today but I'm home now if my makeup looks a little crazy it's because the last like little scene or photo that we did I was supposed to look like I was crying so <laughs> that's why the eyes are giving that I have my nighttime vibes in here you guys know and two of my friends are coming over right now to meet pocket because I think they're gonna watch him next weekend i'm going out of town for like three days and yeah it's like the first time so uh, me being the protective dog mom i'm i am i'm having the friends come over and just like see if they vibe before because i don't want to just throw him out there and not let not have him know like who these people are so gonna do that gonna have a glass of wine with them and we'll see where the night takes me but my bet's on another cozy night in. <laughs> okay, I'm ending the birthday vlog off looking crazy. Pocket and I are starting the week which means there will be a different vlog coming to you later. So thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for the birthday wishes and thanks for celebrating with me. We'll see you in the next one. Pocket out. Mwah.